welcome. I'm Morgan Tracy J, the founder of His Daughter's Closet, Women's Empowerment Ministry. And in today's video, I want to talk to you why you have to do what God is telling you to do. Okay? Because to be honest, guys, um, during my detox, one thing that I really got reworded to me over and over again is that you were made for this. And I want to tell you today, daughter of God out there, you were made for something so much more, something that God specifically has for you. You were made for this. The vision that God has placed in your heart, you have to remember that you was made for that. And I want to tell you, as a woman that's pursuing my vision, I have to reiterate to myself over and over again that I was made for this. The thing about it is a lot of times, our life and maybe comparing ourselves to others on social media we can think how can I ever do that God I will never be able to do that I'll be ever be, never be able to get that amount of numbers I'll never be able to reach that type of people God how will I do this how will my thing flourish how will my vision come to life I want to tell you God says you were made for this the power is inside of you because you have the right tools to bring it to life you were created you were formed you were chosen you was called to do this God is saying and every time that naysayer in your mind comes back and every time maybe family members bring you down and every time that ex-lover's voice comes back, I want to tell you to remember that you was made for this. Every time those childhood memories come back, you have to remember that God was saying, I called you to this. I formed you for this. When you was in your mother's womb, I had called you. And I want to tell you that today, daughters of God. God is saying you were called for this. You were made to do this thing that he's placed within your heart that you're so afraid to step out on that idea that won't go away that vision that comes back day after day that desire of something more that vision that hey God has more for me God is saying you were made for this go for it you have the right tools and resources right now inside of you and God says I will supply what is for me God says do it for him and he will supply you with more open doors more opportunities more blessings more financial blessings God says that you will be prosperous he says he has future for you and I hope of a prosperous future for you. God is saying you were made for this. Stop being afraid and quit looking at the areas that your inadequacies and the areas you fall short and the things that don't look right. God is saying, I made you for this. So when you do this thing, you will flourish. Stop being afraid of it. When you do it in my will and my way, you will flourish. You will blossom. And so daughters of God, I want to tell you today to get fired up in your spirit to remember that that vision that God has placed inside of you, if you don't have a vision, ask for a new one, ask for clarity, ask for a fresh anointing and a fire. But most of all, daughters of God, you need to sit down and you need to say, Lord, let me get built up so I can remember what I was made for what you created me for, what you called me to do, what you predestined me, God, what is my purpose? I want to tell you, daughters of God, get built up because God is saying you were made for it. He created you for it. You can accomplish it. You can go out and do it and it's going to prosper. God is saying that. So when your mind tells you otherwise, when your life tells you otherwise, when your natural sight fails you and tells you it's not coming into fruition, I want you to buckle down and I want you to get stronger in prayer and devotion. I want you to seek the Lord harder. I want you to get on your face before the Lord. I want you to fast and detox and get off social media. I want you to change up your life because God is saying he has something far more better for you. He is saying you were made for so much more. You was made for this. You was chosen and appointed and called to do this. And you have everything you need to bring it to life. Pray you get uplifted and blessed. See you later.